Got a feeling that I belong.
if you close your lower leg, you're asking. So sitting on your seat bones is great right now. If you feel, um, if your lower leg, your heel area is getting close, roll your toes in towards her. <clears throat> we'll take this off. Yep. Very good. And you don't have to have airplane legs. It's just keeping your lower leg off. You know, closing legs means good. Good, Archie looks nice. And he has to like to fairly loose, too. Not that he could be run away or anything like that. But he'll carry his head generally a little nicer if it's a little lighter. Yeah, like that. There you go. Good. All right, 20 arm circles, but not all in a row. Five on each arm that is each direction. All right, pick an arm, pick a green one. Do five of them. One, two, three, four, five. Now change direction. One, same arm. Two, three, four, five. Loosen your shoulder up. All right, ready? Other arm. So switch your range. Forward or backward. One, two, ooh. Three, yeah, four, woo, five, <laughs> and change the direction. One, two, three, four, five. Today, when we were in camp, we were doing our motor picking. We said that that was how we were able to let, get our arms ready to reach for those mulberries. That's Worked perfect. out pretty good. And then the torso twist. Twist and hold it for ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. And now the other way. Shift it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That comes in handy when you're working. When you have somebody, you want to make sure you're not cutting them off. In my case, when I take photos up around the trail, I gotta turn way around and get my camera lined up. So it's a good thing that we got crunchy. Um, let's see here. A little quick trivia. Gail, did you notice that she has something interesting on her rump? Uh, yeah. She's for heaven's sake. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yes. Yes, one of those. Could that be a hot iron brand or a freeze brand? Well, I thought it was the white because it's white. Yes. So so which one, one is the white one? one? I thought that was. I know I do. Um, Yes, uh, that's a fire one, but the freeze brand. Freeze brand is liquid nitrogen, makes the hair grow back white. Hot iron brand, um, Amelia, name of horse that lives at some fire stables that has a hot iron brand. And yes, you have rode him. Which one? No, she's got a scar on it, but that was an actual scar scar. He is still here. This is in the front bar. Yes. Yep. He drank beverages. He might drink soda. Not just Justice. Nope, no fight. He's not from Minnesota. He might like soda. He's not from the North Dakota. Is there a car name to this photo? <laughs> oh, I didn't see, I'm so illiterate on that. Yes, Coda. Coda's got one on the side. LTH. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it could be anywhere on their body. Um, Mary, name another horse that has a brand. I would think so. What kind of brand? Oh, the other one, the cold one. Freeze brand. It's white. Oh. Yep, when it's white, it's a freeze brand. Okay. Yep, that's all right. That's how we're going to learn it. Uh, Gavin, tell me two terms about the thing you were riding. Like, if you were trying to talk the language of horse people. What are you riding? Yes, and? Yeah, that one. There, we're riding a pony. That's a mare. Very good. Technical terms there. Love it. So then, what about you, Edison? Tell me some technical terms about what you're riding. He's a horse, but not a pony. He needs to. Here. 
Yes, shelving. All right. Whoa. And the workers have a half a more of a look at his face on his bridle. Is there a bit in his mouth or a half a more around his nose? Yes, he was a bit. Very good. Um, is your horse shod? Any shoes on the front or barefoot? Shod or barefoot? No. When you did you pick up to somebody? Did you pick up? Yeah. No metal, anything on his feet. He's barefoot. I know it's hard to remember sometimes. But he is barefoot. All right, I think we have tortured everybody. So now that we get to our second gear, there are a few that are going to be fast. And you, Gail, you're on the hot rod. So you're going to have to add a little bit of range, a lot of bit of range. You're going to use five more range than you've ever used on any animal here before. And yep, not yet. You've got to wait. Oh, as in that tight in your range, about six inches. <laughs> They're going to be snug, snug on. Uh, Anna, what about yours? Fast, slow, or in the middle? Slow. So hand down. Don't be pulling on his mouth. Hand down. Deal with your legs. Tap, tap with the reins when you need it, but only after you use your feet first. Feet and voice. What about Bob? Fast, slow, or in the middle? Slow. So all you gotta do is sit there and just keep the rhythm of this in your seat. So belly button in, everything like this. This way right here, and just stick them up and down. What about him? Fast to medium. He's got to slow down a bit, but more importantly, what do you got to do with his body? Yeah, so you're going to take, when you bump, you might actually have to close your legs here. Bump, bump, close your legs, and then relax. Bump, bump, close your legs right here, sit back, and then put your hand down. Tell him, put your head down and trot at the same time. Gavin, what are you on? Fast forward in the middle. Fast. You and Gail are the ones that are going to be hot lapping everybody. So, see the red color on your reins? Honestly, you're going to be in that. He's that strong. Don't panic if you're like, oh my gosh. If you feel that you can't do with one hand, two hands. Heels down, sit back. She was pretty strong for someone yesterday. She actually had to go into a timeout. But the person was a lot smaller than her. So, you're going to have to use some strength. By the way, no kicking. So don't talk to her here. There's no sound effect. No clicking, no nothing. She will go. Um, but, but do try to resist and slow down. Resist, slow your butt. Resist, slow your butt. Archie, where are you? What do you think about that critter? Medium. Medium, now slow, medium. Everything on the board. Straight, zigzag, all over the place. You have a medley of everything possible in one horse. Yep. All right, everybody, so gather up on the fast ones. So that would be Gail and Gavin, the D&D. Okay, the Gs, the Gs. You guys are going to be holding a little bit. And notice they, they are both what? There's something in common between the CD and Cutie. Yes, they're both bears. So isn't that interesting? It's bears with the hot Interesting. All right, second gear, everybody. Hand down, rock your butt, little keyword. Good. Go no faster than that. Yeah, that's perfect. Have a little connection on the ring so that there's a constant communication. No slack or looseness to your race. Not hanging on her, but a light connection. Good. Now you're on a slow horse. We're going to get everyone slow on the outside so that Mary, you can have the inside. Out from the bottom. Yep. Good. Let's start making the call, Anna. Turn your toes away, you can pass your heel. Slow on the outside. Gavin has the perfect speed. Oh, you're not trying to get it. Go ahead and get it in the speed. Tap speed? With energy. With energy. Yeah, speed and you can back when you do it. So Connor needs to be on the rail, he needs to be on the rail. Keep playing with the head a little bit. It's, it's this way, backwards. Slide your hand, almost past your hip. Bump, bump, and then put your hand up. Bump, bump, put your hand up. Bump, bump, do it again. Bump, bump. Bump, 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 you're almost there. Can you tighten your weight just a little bit right now, you know? He can do better. Bump, 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 bump. 
just a little crown, but wrap in the outside leg. It's going to push along the rail. And then reaching, picking up and reaching forward. You are standing up with the same rhythm with it. Okay, keep that in this direction. You can grab weight, Edison. You can't wait in line. Remember I said the BFF. Turn, Edison. Turn. Nope, he's got to go another round. He'll live. Yep. Sometimes horses do that. They don't stand in line and they don't even drink. So that means they're stalling. That means he's not doing what he's supposed to be doing, which is getting a little exercise. No bad done all day today? Zero. He's got at the, he went to the little bale barn, ate hay, and went out to grass, ate grass. He took a nap out there and then he came back. And Bob has done nothing but other than what we were doing. So he's in school right now. Yes, exactly. Lord knows we're not giving him full retirement because he will be nothing but a wild horse. He will be unmanageable. And uh, Anna could let out of her hand. Yeah. He's sure. The reason that he's not going forward is he feels a little bit of break on him. Alright. Gail, can you start us out? We're going to come this way, right here and ride in a circle around these cones that I'm setting up. And we're going to do that for all these different shoots. So go between there, outside this cone, outside this cone, and eventually we're all going to do this at a truck. Okay, get the other one. Oh, yep. oh. Uh -huh. there. Ah, sweet. And then the next one, same thing, the next one, same thing. I measure this one down just a tad. So here, always inward. So go that way. Now you don't get the guy's home. So yes, Edison, can you do the same thing? Drive between those rails on the outside of those We didn't. Nobody did look good. You know what? It was, um,